Turning from the Westminster, we wanted to give felines their fair due by seeing what really goes on in a cat show, like the CFA Cat Show. They feature up to 40 unique pedigreed breeds and even have a category for domestic household cats, such as someone we at Pet Pals TV recognized. Look who I ran into, Flash the therapy cat, the infamous therapy cat, and his mama, Jayetta Hall. Jayetta, tell us, why do you do cat shows also besides all the wonderful therapy work that Flash is involved in? Well, I'm doing cat shows now to basically get our word out about the therapy and all that stuff. So that's why I'm kind of doing the cat shows now. Makes sense for Flash, as he was recently featured in Cat Fancy Magazine for his therapy work. But why do others participate in national cat shows? I think it's just the challenge of producing a beautiful specimen of a breed that you love. It's a way I get to interact with my cat, bond with my cat, meet great people. It's fun. Every competing feline was just stunning. So how do judges make decisions at such shows? Every cat is being judged against its standard of perfection for the breed which the judge has studied and knows very well. So what are just some of the standards in a few of the breeds? Take the American Shorthair Cat, the true working breed of the Shorthair Division. They're cats that have a very distinctive muzzle so that they can easily grasp prey, and they have a very distinctive harsh outer texture and thick undercoat so that this cat, if he would get outside by accident, he could survive or the mountain lion looking cat called the Abyssinian. The coat is one thing because it's very ticked like, like a, a wild animal. Every piece of fur has four different colors if you look at it very closely. And these cats are professional at what they do at cat shows because they're held almost every weekend all over the country. Check online to see when one is being held near you. Well, after a full day at the All Breed Cat Show, I have to agree it is definitely a cat's life. And these babies are perfectly content living it. For Pet Pals TV, I'm Buffy Pine.